getting ready for hockey night here in the Carolinas on Saturday night along with Chip Tracy and Shane Willis and our fantastic Valley Sports crew. And here we go. Carolina and L.A. underway. Marty Natchez with a game-winning goal as Foss knocks down the clearing attempt. Carolina kicking the pressure on. Right down Broadway with a shot as Shane Quick makes the save. Still loose. It's Kokanian and the rebound and he scores! Carolina, 37 seconds in. Up 1-0. Kokaniemi play to the whistle. Pressure from Tara Bynan. Support. You keep the puck in and then the wise pitch after the breakdown from the wingers from L.A. The initial shot from Shea. And Kokaniemi just did not assume that Quick had it. Locates the puck and scores. The video review room would maybe have more looks. Following review, the puck was played with a stick below the height of the shoulder. Is a good goal. You take the chance. You're early in the game. You rely on your kill. And maybe you win it. Now, Andrew Podorowski, who got his first NHL point, wins the draw. Now, Foster. not so good of a challenge. You win puck possession because of Niederreiter and Podokorowski. And then you get to the front of the net, you get to the middle, and Jesper Pons stick on both goals now has been golden. Keeping it in here is the Canes do have the luxury of having 12 forwards tonight, but a loose puck picked up. L.A. coming into the hurricane zone and Anderson with the save right away. Good save. You have to limit your transition chances against. That was one thing that I thought needed to be improved upon from Detroit. Now Lemieux throws it out in front and Roy's shot doesn't get through. Puck played along the boards. Finds its way to Roy. Roy snaps one right on and Anderson gobbles that one up. He'll hang on for a faceoff. And uh, has been given the opportunity with everything that's gone on has, and has taken full advantage. He was the AHL's leading scorer last year. He was leading the AHL this year. Now the draws kept in and Anderson with another big save. Second attempt. He'll swap that away, denying Arvidsson twice. L.A. looking to apply more pressure here on the Carolina Hurricanes. Philip Deneau walking out from the corner. He'll snap one right on and Anderson kicks that away. Now Foss trying to clear. Arvidsson will throw it deep into the Canes corner. Shea and Ayafalo go after it. Adrian Kempe with it. Kempe, two goals against the Canes on that Saturday game in November in L.A. Now Kempe gets another chance. Anderson denies him with the pad. Nason. And let's look at this save. He anticipates that hits something, locates with his eyes, and then moves into the shooting funnel. As Labo doing excellent work behind the Kings net. Trying to come away with a puck. He'll get some help. Throw it to the point. As Brendan Smith's shot is detected and caught by Jonathan Quick. He played out quickly by Christian Willanen. Now Kopitar. Kopitar tries to send one in and crashing into Anderson is Kempe. And both player and puck stay out of the net. Will be interference. Saucer from Kopitar. Kempe wins the race in the net. Kopitar does everything but score. See the interference from Shea. And watch what Anderson does here. Wow, look at how strong he was down low. Kopitar. He'll go rink wide to Kempe. Up top to Dursey. Now it's Kopitar. He'll get it back. Dursey shot right on. Rebound is available. I follow can't get a stick to it. Excellent play there by Vincent Trocek. Pesci to Code Kenyemi. He'll send it across Ike Shea. He hammers one. Rebound chance quick with the save. Follow-up opportunity. And that'll be knocked away. Oh, a golden opportunity for the Canes. But if not, create a rebound. That's why he went to the glove side. And Foss nearly had his second of the period. Ten seconds left in the first. Kopitar with it in the high slot. His pass deflected by Niederreiter. Niederreiter with a good reverse hit on Lemieux, but the puck squeaks free, and Anderson has to be ready as time expires. After taking a hit from Kings defenseman Sean Dursey. So that's how we start the second period with that note. The Canes right on time starting this with a chance to keep the puck in as Brady Shea at the blue line on a wrap chance. That quick knocked away. It's kept in by Pesci. He'll get it down low for Levo. Levo. Gets it back up top. Pesci shot the score! Jack Drury was out in front. 
The puck eludes Jonathan Quick, and the Canes are up 3 nothing. Like he did not contact it. Can't tell if he did. I can tell you, Labo did a heck of a job below the goal line. Gets the puck with pace. Back to Pesci. I think this is Pesci's goal, but ready shoot hockey. It may have contacted. Now Dersey. Ian Kempe will play with it, and he'll lose it. Now Trocek's got a breakaway. With speed, Trocek in on Quick. On the backhand, and Quick has to make the save as Trocek was out of steam at the end of this shift. Position draws the high stick, and this is where Trocek, even at the end of his shift, is looking to settle it to make that puck flat, and it drifts on it. Tara Wynan with lead to D'Angelo. Now Trocek, backhand pass D'Angelo to Tara Wynan to Coach Kiniemi. Back to D'Angelo. To Tara Vine and Tara Vine and shot, he scores! A wrister on the power play for Tavo Tara Vine and a 4-0 lead for the Hurricanes. Right here, he drew three guys. And then the pump fake from Tony D'Angelo. So the bumper play from Koganiemi and then the pump before he went to the flank. Tara Vine on his natural side. Tavo took a look, used Anderson as a screen. A product of Yale who won that huge game over the St. Louis Blues for Carolina. Uh, Tara Vinen, he'll send the puck for Kokaniemi. Kokaniemi, he'll get it out, and Shea Point on a shot that Quick has to make the shoulder save on. That goes off of a body into the corner. Bear looks to clear. He'll get help from Faust, and Carolina gets the puck to the neutral zone, but right back in to the Canes zone. Lazat with a move. He'll take a shot and score. Blake Lazat picks the corner. And the Kings have broken through with 4.27 left in the second period. Turnover just on the far side of the red line. Then he makes a move, a heck of a move. Backhand forehand to get Smith to commit. And what a rising shot. You can tell Anderson drifted a little bit to the short side, but Lazat, you look at player that excelled it. Face off. Eventually we'll get to it as Vincent Trocek will dig in. He'll take it away from Deneau, and the Canes will wrap this puck here into the L.A. King zone. Ardvidsson, his back pass, and Drury returns the favor with a steal. And now his pass sending in all alone with the shot, and Stepan is robbed by Quick as Derek Stepan on a marvelous pass from Drury was in all alone. To create the chance... And here is where Drury had first turned the puck over, but didn't chase that mistake. Found Stefan. The Kings were offside. So time just melting away. 535 left here in the third. Now Drury's in a quick and he scores. Jack Drury, stick to it and miss his second NHL goal. And this one is a beaut. Top shelf, Jack Drury. What a pass, the cross ice pass from Stepan. Just a, really a direction of the puck. And then the snipe. One toucher from Stepan from Smith. And perfect placement from Jack Drury and another memorable celebration. To beat Jonathan Quick with a snipe of all snipe. The refs say move it. Gaines do Lavo. He'll knock it down. And Jack Drury has it with two seconds, one second. He'll wrist one, and then he'll get a little shove for his problems by Matt Roy.